Good morning, you guys. It is Thursday morning and we're here in town and we're about to do our grocery shopping. And today is gonna be a little bit different because I'm gonna be grocery shopping for two weeks instead of one. I just wanna get my grocery shopping out of the way and not have to come back for Thanksgiving week. So it's gonna be kind of a bigger grocery haul and it'll probably take me a little bit longer. Um, but yeah, we're gonna head into our first store, which is Grocery Outlet. And then after here, we have Safeway and Winco. So we will check in with you guys when we get back home. Bye. Bye. Okay guys, we are back home from grocery shopping. I just laid everything out. The grocery store, like I thought it would be, was just pure chaos. And I'm really excited that I went shopping for the next two weeks so I don't have to go back next week. But before I show you everything that I picked up, I'm gonna show you my meal plan for the next two weeks. All right guys, here is my meal plan. I just wrote it out real quickly. Kind of messy handwriting, but this is for the next 13 days, the rest of the month. So tonight, Thursday, we're gonna do hamburger helper, salad and corn. Tomorrow, Michael's getting a tattoo, and so we always have pizza on those nights. So we're gonna do a pizza night with veggies. Saturday, we are going to a birthday party, and we're gonna be eating pizza there, and I figured we probably wouldn't be too hungry, so we'll just do a snack plate for dinner. Sunday, we're gonna do crispy chicken salads. Monday will be chicken curry with naan. Tuesday will be jambalaya with cornbread. Wednesday will be pork stew, which is some leftovers that I froze. Thursday is Thanksgiving. Friday, we're gonna have another pizza night because Michael has another tattoo. And then the same thing, just with veggies. Saturday, we're gonna have Mississippi pot roast sliders with tots and salad. Sunday, we're gonna do, that's actually Oakley's birthday and she requested ribs, mac and cheese, and peas. Monday, we're gonna do a leftovers day, and then Tuesday will be turkey tacos. Guys, this is everything that I picked up for the next 13 days. I'm hoping hoping it will last us. I went to three different stores. I went to Grocery Outlet, Safeway, and Winco. I tried to keep everything separate, but it did not work out. So over here, I have this little corner. This is my Grocery Outlet stuff. I got two things of buttered popcorn rice cakes. I absolutely love rice cakes and I have not been buying them recently because they've gotten so expensive. But these were on sale at Grocery Outlet for 99 cents a piece, so I got two. I found some canned pumpkin that was a good price. I think it was like $1.20 something a can. I got my favorite hummus, which is roasted pine nut, some sliced pepper jack cheese, and some shredded Kobe jack cheese. And that was everything that I picked up at Grocery Outlet. The rest of the stuff on the table is either from Winco or Safeway and I couldn't keep it separate so I'll just show you guys everything all at once. So starting over here I got some more whole milk for Barrett. Oakley wanted cashew milk and then I got two creamers. I got peppermint mocha and I also got this caramel. I picked up some orange juice to have on the weekends for our special breakfast. I got two light sour creams, two things of cottage cheese. This was a good deal at Safeway. Um, it's the lean ground turkey, $1.99 a pound, so I picked up five pounds of that. I picked up two pie crusts from Safeway also. On Thanksgiving, I'm in charge of making homemade rolls and bringing a dessert. So I figured I would make a apple pie and a pumpkin pie. 
I normally only can find this at Walmart, but when I was doing my Safeway pickup order, I saw that they had it, so I picked up two Country Crock plant butters. I got, let's see here, some hard salami, some pepperoni, and some ham off the bone lunch meat. Um, we'll just normally we use the salami and the pepperoni either on sandwiches or when we do snack plates. I got this Johnsonville sausage. This was from Safeway. I can't remember the price, but it was an okay price. And then these are the ribs that we're having for Oakley's birthday. Just some, um, why can't I think it was called? Like pork spare ribs. This was my freebie from Safeway. I picked up two pounds of lean ground beef at Winco. And then I also saw this, which is a pound and a half of patties, which you don't have to cook it up as patties. You could just do it like ground meat, but only four fifty three a pound, which is a really good price. Ground beef is really expensive lately. I was looking, um, they had some ground beef that was like six eighteen a pound for um, 93 seven, which just seems crazy to me. I got an 18 pack of eggs. I got an eight candle for Oakley's birthday. I got some more Diet Pepsi. I got this bag of Quick Oats. I was almost out after making those monster cookies the other day. And then, oh, I don't know if I told you about these. I got these at Safeway too. Oakley asked for her dessert on her birthday if she could have ice cream. So we're doing chocolate peanut butter ice cream. And then this one is our absolute favorite and it's the Tillamook monster cookie ice cream. So those were only 97 cents at Safeway, which is a really good deal. I picked up one can of evaporated milk for my pumpkin pie. And then this was next to it. And I like to keep a couple of these on hand for baking. So I got a thing of condensed milk. Now, I don't think I have ever bought Hamburger Helper as an adult, but every time we go to Grocery Outlet, there's a big pile of these Hamburger Helpers, and the kids always ask to buy one, and I always say no. So I decided that this week I would let them pick one out, but then we get to Grocery Outlet, and they didn't have any. So I got these at Winco, and the kids picked them out. Double cheeseburger macaroni. We're going to have those for dinner tonight. I just got some white cheddar um, crackers some Weiler's um, little drink mixes. This is pink lemonade, it's my favorite. I got this ranch at Safeway, a bag of, um, not potato chips, tortilla chips. I got this barbecue sauce for when we have ribs. And then I got a couple canned food items. I got kidney beans, a couple things of chili beans and tomato sauce, some more coconut milk, black beans, diced tomatoes, diced tomatoes with green chilies, green beans, tomato sauce, and corn. I picked up four more Powerades. I got two loaves of bread. And then for the produce, I got this at Safeway. It was 97 cents a pound. So I think I got, I thought it was by the pound again. I guess it was by the head. So I got three heads of broccoli. I got one pineapple, some more asparagus. We had some last week and it was so good and I've been craving more. I figured we would have this on our salads, our crispy chicken salad. So I got asparagus, two cucumbers, five, four, four zucchinis, two jalapenos, some Granny Smith apples for my apple pie, some pears, lettuce, mini bell peppers, and onions. Oh, and this bag of red seedless grapes. And I think that's everything that I picked up. I don't think I missed anything this week. So I will calculate all those receipts and add them to the screen here for you guys. All right, guys, here is my monthly budget sheet for November. As you can see, it's a mess like always. These are the four days that I went grocery shopping. Even though it's the 18th, this will be my last shopping trip of November. So this shopping trip was $155.78 leaving the monthly total at $617.21, which is $17.21 over budget, but not bad, especially since I was able to stock up on some meat. So that is the end of this grocery haul video for today. I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for tagging along, and we'll catch you on the next one.